Yo, welcome back to Matt. So today we'll be looking at the inverse function. So basically inverse function uh, is very simple to do. So first example they given fx is equals to 3x plus 4. So before we solving this become an inverse function, I'll teach you the way how we convert this into a inverse function or how do we solve a inverse function. So go with the steps. So first, I will always change my x into y. And the second step, I will make it equals to x. And the third step, I will find y. Okay, now follow the step by step. So first, I'd say, but change the x into y. So basically, it become 3y plus 4. All right, after that, make it equals to x. So make it equals to x and find the y. So find the y, so 3y equals to x. So plus 4, move it there, become a minus 4. So to find y, your 3 have to be moving to the other side, so x minus 4 divided by 3. And this y is basically known as the inverse function, which is f negative 1 x. All right, so basically your inverse function will be written as f negative 1 x equals to x minus 4 over 3. So that's my final part.